Okay, what is up you guys? Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make my um overdrive sound. This is one of the daily uploads. Um it's basically that little overdrive before you hear before the drop. Uh, if you guys haven't listened to that track, I'll leave a link in description. Um but yeah, we're going to be making that. I'm going to play it in a second before I get started. Um I just want to announce to you guys that the merch store will be open tomorrow, if not a little bit after this video, but it will for sure be up tomorrow. So if you guys want to, you know, support me directly and on top of that, like, you know, wear some Zanwell merch, that'll be awesome. I've made um, different sweaters and different shirts. So it's not just one design. It's, I think, about four different designs. So it's not all the same. It has um, my motto on it, which is innovate, don't replicate. That's my motto. And, um, but yeah, um, hope you guys really enjoy that. I'll leave a link in the description to the store once I get it because it's finished right now. But I just want to kind of, you know, wait till I make an actual separate video on it. So I think I might make a separate video tonight or something on merch. So yeah, you guys should totally go um, check that out. But now we're going to get back. We're going to get to the tutorial. So I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make that overdrive sound. So this is what we're going to be making. Overdrive. Okay, so you guys heard the overdrive. That's what we're going to be basically doing. It's actually one of the most simple things to make ever. Um, some people thought I actually just sampled it and like from something saying overdrive, but really, it's just the speech synthesizer on FL Studio that a lot of people surprisingly don't know about. So um, it's in the channels. You just go right here and then you uh, go down, click speech synthesizer, and it's right there. Um, so let's see this. Um, okay, so I got to create another one. So speech synthesizer okay so here's another speech synthesizer so this is what we're gonna do we're gonna type in overdrive we're gonna listen to that overdrive. so that's too fast so we need to slow down to 128 overdrive. that's still too fast overdrive let's do overdrive. there you go it's getting there overdrive. so that's pretty much um how I got it but then I did some other stuff to it so it was robotoid and it was monotone was natural overdrive. Overdrive. I think I had it overdrive. 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 um but yeah it's pretty much pretty much what it is you guys can mess around with it a little bit but that's pretty much what it was there's a few different ones um I think it might have been this one. Let me see. Overdrive. Overdrive. Uh. Overdrive. 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 But it was Robotoy most Overdrive. likely. Overdrive. 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 Some pretty cool stuff in here. Overdrive. It was a Robotoy. But we just gotta pitch it down a bit to get it to how it is in here. So it should be good. Overdrive. So let's do that. Oh wait, that's what I did. I pitched. Overdrive. There you go. Something like that. Overdrive. Overdrive. So let's accept that. Let's save it. It's overdrive. Robotoid. There you go. Overdrive. So let's listen to this. Overdrive. Overdrive. So what I did essentially, so that's just the basic, um, that's the base. So that's how we're going to get that. And it's just, we get Robotoid. So we're going to, um, Overdrive. meet that and we're going to put it into the playlist. So now we have this, we're just going to keep repeating it over and over again. And we're going to put a vocoder in because that's what gives it that crispy, um, overdrive sound that it has. It doesn't get it just stock. So you have to actually put some effort in so let's do that overdrive overdrive so now it's going to create a vocoder up here um i mean vocodex not vocoder so yeah overdrive 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 so yeah just overdrive. follow along what i'm doing hopefully i'm not going too fast but i can't really explain everything i'm doing sometimes it could be hard but yeah overdrive overdrive Overdrive. 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 
Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Overdrive. Don't want that. Overdrive. Overdrive. Had to Overdrive. 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 But yeah, this is pretty much, it was a lot more processing because I had stuff on the master. But essentially, that's pretty much what I did. Um, I had a sound goodizer just for a little bit of saturation. Overdrive. 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 And then on top of that, I took a parametric EQ. I think I either, let me see, let me listen to this one more time. Overdrive. Okay, it sounded like I boosted the lows. Overdrive. 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 So, what, and another thing I did is I cut off the tail because I didn't like that. V that kind of so it's like over dry. It sounds like over dry, like, you know, like over drying clothes or something. But it says overdrive, so. Overdrive. You're trying to get it to cut off suddenly. You don't want that v, because then it takes away from the drop or whatever you're trying to do. So overdrive. So yeah, just like that. Overdrive. So let's see if we can line it up. Overdrive. Overdrive. Over. Oh wait. Over. Yeah, I think it lines up. So let's see. Let's listen to the differences. You know, there's a lot more stuff going on in the other one. Overdrive. 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 But yeah, that's pretty much how um I made the overdrive sound. Um, it was really cool. It was a fun track to make. I made it pretty quickly. I feel like I could have done better, better mixing because it's one of those tracks that I forgot. I forget I even made because it's just like. I don't know, but a lot of times I forget I even have that track. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I hope it helped you guys out. You guys can make some pretty cool effects in like some little boot up bop bop with some like Robux sounds, which is really cool. And you can be really creative with it. But yeah, make sure you guys check out the merch though, because it will be up. If not later tonight, it will be for sure tomorrow because I'm... Um, I want to do tomorrow, but I'm getting kind of impatient. I just want to freaking, you know, put the store link on my Twitter and stuff. But I'm going to wait to make a whole video for that and announce the merch. And I actually bought some because I waited until I bought some to tell you guys to buy it because I wanted to make sure it's good quality and the, the fabric's good. And um, I, I wore it to school today. Got a, a lot of people, you know, compliments on it. And a lot of people um, uh, asked about it and a few of them were willing to buy it. So it's really good material it's really nice um we're in it right now actually but yeah, i'm gonna make a video on that and tell you guys more about it but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did subscribe share with your producer friends and stuff but yeah, i hope you guys i hope you guys have a nice day or night whatever time is wherever you are it's zan wow peace